um, I'll start, I'll do it the other way this time. Uh, yeah, we, we run a record label called Ruction Records. Well, I run a label with the guys from Nine Bar and Knuckle Dust and Poppy. And, uh, oh, no, I'm yeah, I'm <laughs> and uh, <laughs> um, let me see. Yeah, we've been putting on shows since about 1997. Started going to shows around 95. Maybe earlier, 94. I don't know. What's that? Remember, hardcore shows. Uh, not too sure. Not for you anyway. No, but um, yeah, I'm younger than you. But <laughs> I'm better looking. Yeah, we started doing. Yeah, I think I put my first show on in 1997. It was like Knuckle Dust, Nine Bar, Gum Dog, Public Disturbance, Up Against It, and um, that was a long time ago. Now Ruxton has got like a regular night in London, right in the heart of London. We put shows on every single month. You can see bands from London, bands from the rest of the UK, Europe, sometimes America and abroad. And um, yeah, I can't think of what else to say. Um, yeah, I play in a few bands myself. I play in Nine Bar, Injury Time, joined Cartel recently. Um, Cartel just recorded a new record, it's going to be good, it's going to come out soon. Um, I'm not sure what else to say. <laughs> you, to, you, do you have anything to say? Yeah, yeah. I yeah. say, yeah. Um, we go and show since '95. Uh, first band I saw was Superville Strife. Um, we didn't really know any kids back then. Whoa, monkey jumping <laughs> around me! See that crazy shit? <laughs> and uh, probably got fleas or some shit. Yeah. But yeah, like we didn't know any kids back then. There was uh, one kid who'd done a stage dive to Strife, and it turned out to be Pierre from Knuckle Dust. No one knew him then. And um, yeah, began show since. It's changed a lot, the hardcore scene. It, it's a little bit more commercial on a bigger sense in London, but you've still got the small Russian DIY shows. Um, yeah, the kids have seemed to be more into tattoos rather than uh, the actual hardcore bands themselves, from what I've got to say. But the good thing about coming from London... The uh, of the big monkey, yeah, the good <laughs> thing about coming from London and being part of Russian and LBU is that we get to meet all kinds of people coming over from all around the world. They come stay with us, and then we go stay with them. So you know. So we've ended up. So we can go see Anis in Singapore. Through. We go to uh, Pennsylvania, hang out with the BFL boys. You know, it's good. It's a nice network of people. We get to see people. So you're, you're still active in the uh, London scene. Yeah. Doing some yeah, 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 yeah. 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 What's that? With Mary? What's that? With the guys. Still active there? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, um, I'm trying to think. Yeah, we, we, we still have our monthly night. Yeah. Like first, sat hang first Saturday of every month. If you're in London, come to the 12 Bar uh, on Denmark Street. It's like right in the heart of London. And yeah, still putting on shows, designing T-shirts, all that good stuff. <laughs> all the kids still come out. All the old faces. You know, Nine Bar, Fifty Caliber, Knuckle Dust. Yeah, we all grew up together in a way, for the last 15 or 17 years, 18 years, a long time. What was the latest uh, release for Eruption? Um, the latest release, I'm not sure if it's out, it might be out now, because I'm up forward, so I don't know, but it's the new True Valiance record. Um, and then after that, I think, it'll probably be the new Cartel record, it's like a new EP. And um, I'm, I'm playing guitar on this one, I wasn't on the old one, and um, yeah, that's it's sounding fat from what we've heard already and uh, it's, I've only got the unmixed thing but it's sounding pretty good and I don't know when that will be out yeah I guess sometime after uh, I come back from this holiday in Asia <laughs> if you are in London just come with me um, I'll take you to places uh, most of friends happy ending really cool really fun and uh, yeah we have a good time happy ending for you so, so you I guys came to KLL to get a happy ending, <laughs> but she hurt me instead. So you guys really have fun here? Yeah, I love it. Love yeah, it. What do you like time. to see, man? Are you? Uh, I want to go to uh, Penang, I want to go see other places. KL's cool. It's hot. I can't take the heat, you know. White boys, it, it, it's too hot. Yeah, it's too man. But, um, you know, the people are very nice, kind. The ladies are very nice, too. Mm. You know, it's a bit expensive, but it's all cool. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, and, and, and what Mary want to say something about a July 14th on the OVC anniversary? Yeah, oh, yeah July yeah, 14th. He will be there with us together. And uh, one so check, check it out if you want to know anything about London scene or Russian record, just ask him and you're going to be adding Makati. Right? I hope you up. <laughs> If his, if his CDs arrive and his bag arrives. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. When, when I eventually get my luggage back from the airport, I've got some CDs. <laughs> <laughs>
So thanks for checking out for the short interview. Let's see you again. Thanks Cheers. a lot. Cheers. Take it easy. Yeah, after that, we'll become big fucking man. I'm getting away from that, dude. <laughs>